Hi everybody, how are you today? Holidays are over, it's the new year. January 3rd, 2020. Where did that come from, right? 2020. But here we are, and here we are doing some of our favorite things. And you know what our favorite things are? Babies. I met today uh, with the artist of this baby. We haven't seen each other for a while, so we had a really, really great visit. And uh, she was so generous, so generous, she always is. Um, so I'm gonna show you, before we get to the good stuff, I'm gonna show you the sweet stuff. And that is some of the things that she gave me. So here we have a white, super soft blanket with white satin trim, and it is really soft. If I want this baby to be a boy, which you tell me, I think she's a girl, but I have this little outfit, little pajamas, and it even has a star, a star on the toes, look at that. Too cute. And then I also got this Layette set, this blanket, which I think could be for a girl as well as a boy. I don't think it really matters. It's just meant green and gray and yellow. And it's a, a one piece sleeper with a matching sleeping cap. Really cute. And I love this color on this baby. I do. This green color and this baby is a girl I almost put matter of fact I did put this outfit on her and then my friend said you know those are pajamas and I go yeah I probably should change her let her wear some real clothes when she's going out isn't that cute can you see the bling on it love it too good, and I, I do have to say that I have been so blessed with good friends. Um, I have been blessed um, just much more than I deserve, that's for sure. Here's another blanket, super soft, look at that. Looks like Dumbo, doesn't it? The clouds parachuting him down. But I love this color on this girl. And here is the birth certificate. So now you know, Kara McGraw is the reborn artist and she's my dear sister friend. And we had such a great time today. Kara, thank you. Thank you so much for her because I've been looking for her, looking at her for a while. And I'm so glad we were able to work it out to where I could adopt her and bring her home. She's a limited kit, Dallas. Are you ready? I know you're ready, because I'm ready. Here we go. Here she is. And did you notice the birth certificate said 7.7 .7 pounds? She feels like, I mean, look, even the way she cuddles, She's like, Mom, it was, an, it was an hour and a half drive home. I'm tired. She's tired, look at her. She's like, please. Isn't she precious? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna try to get the camera here and show you her details. Can you see them? I love her. Everything is perfect about her. You know, I do not have a baby that has rooted hair and painted hair. And Kara did give me a, a really cute pink hairbrush and some hair conditioner to put on her as well. So you see she is rooted, but then she's also painted. And I got a little bit of fly away there, but look how sweet. What a sweet baby girl. And then she also gave her this outfit. So I, I brought her home in this outfit. It looked like her. 
beautiful and she is she is that aren't you i think i might pierce her ears too do you think she might look good with pierced ears i think she might oh she's so sweet i have been blessed um this was an unexpected adoption but i'm i'm blessed that i was able to adopt her and i'm so grateful to kara for all her hard work making these babies for us. Look at her. She's just beautiful. She's beautiful. I'm gonna take her babysitting with me today. I am. Well, she is really tired. And I just wanna say again, thank you, Kara, so much for everything. Our friendship, our time together, the goodies that you um, put in for me to bring home with her, for her. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody, for watching. God bless you in 2020.